Welcome back, everybody, for another Empire on the Sea scenario. Seems like people enjoyed Phoenician Origins, so let's move right along into Dido's City, or Dido's City. So this is like uh, almost 190 years later. Phoenicia, 814 BCE. Dido, Dido, would be, would be Queen of Tyre. Uh, your brother Pygmalion has seized the throne. The city is not large enough for the both of you, so you've gathered supporters at the docks. Uh, they'll join you on a journey to the western lands to the set to have been visited by the god Melkart centuries ago. Retrace the voyage of the ancient god and found a Carthage, a new city in a western homeland. Alrighty. Um, oh, here we are. We really don't have much to go off of. Uh, oh boy. Uh, build a government center and temple on the site of Carthage. Follow voyages of the god Melkart by capturing uh, the ruins commemorating his exploits. Defeat the Etrurians, defeat the Numidians, uh, pass through the pir Pillars of Heracles, defeat the Camel tribes of the African desert, and mine the gold of Iberia to the west. Pop loan of 75. Explore Tyre, but do not spend too much time there. Your enemies across the sea grow in power. Uh, there are many possibilities for a first settlement, including Carthage, Cyprus, Anatolia, or other lands. Oh, we don't need to go with Carthage first? The Phoenicians establish a trade empire across the Mediterranean. Do not feel limited to one settlement, but always look for resources in new lands. The Greek colonists of uh, Cyrenaica are peaceful and will not mind you building a colony near them. You will quickly compete for limited resources, however. Uh, barbarian tribes inhabit many of the lands that Melkart visited and then will need, need to be subjugated to capture Melkart's ruins. Gold is very rare, so trade with Tyre and Saranaika can support your armies. All right. So you can pause the video if you want to read all this. Oh, wait. I also have a composite bowman. Hold on. Well, I mean, here's Tyre. Tyre. Tire. All right, so uh, I am the Carthaginians now. Tyrians are the Phoenicians, Greeks, Cyrenaicans, Etrurians are Romans, Numidians are Assyrians, and the tribes are Hittites. Okay, we got a scout too. But those guys are already enemies, so part of me thinks that it might not be a bad idea to start on Cyprus. Which I think would be here. Um... That was a little bit awkward, I won't lie. And I thought Cyprus would be like the safe starting point. Are we supposed to go right to Carthage? Carthage, Cyprus, Anatolia, or other lands. Hmm. 
Okay. What if I take the composite bowmen and try to debate them into the galleys? Maybe that's what I was supposed to do. Yeah, that was what I was supposed to do. All right, so here we are on Cyprus. It ain't much, but it's home. At least to start us off. Fish numbers seem pretty low, though, honestly. Oh, oh boy, we gotta do this slowly. But we can easily trade with uh, our homeland, Tyre, Tyr. Oh yeah, who, is our, who are our enemies? Everybody except Tyre and Serenica. We are in the Tool Age. This, I think, is probably Anatolia. On this. Right, this I guess is Peloponnesus. Uh oh. Well, the war galley is going to be a lot stronger. Hey, what are the Carthage bonuses again? Start with plus 50 of all resources. Academy units and elephant units get extra hit points. Camel riders get plus 15%. Fire galleys attack faster, transports move faster, and nobility is free. Um, so, so oh yeah, but you don't have a, a lot of the last uh, like attack and armor upgrades. So we go for elephants. Camels I don't really like in this game. Okay, elephants, centurions, some heliopoli. All of that sounds just fine. But we have a much larger population limit this time, which is always handy. How much are houses in this game? 30? Probably explains why uh, originally in Age of Kings, in Age of Conquerors, houses were 30 wood as well. This is probably Greece itself. Might as well. These guys are already getting some value. Anything we can do to put these guys behind? Rogan? Rogan? Oh, how much is the storage? Oh, it's 120 wood. Oh. But the Greeks, I imagine, would contest us in Anatolia. Let's 
gonna dock up over there. Oh, we need another house, because houses are annoying in this game with only the four pop space. Also add in some fishing ships. Okay, so can you not get trade ship? Okay, you need to get to the Bronze Age for the trade boats. Which means we're going to need to find gold. Hopefully there will be some in Anatolia. Guess we'll just you know we get ourselves started and then uh, we switch on over oh it's 40 food 20 foot So you need to build ourselves a nice little maritime empire. And we'll just start working our way over to the west of the map more slowly and steadily. Come on. There you go. Okay, we're going to land these guys over here and see what we can see. Alrighty, let's start transporting bills over. The big thing we're on the lookout for is gold. Uh, bad micro. We're in the Dark Age equivalent. Okay, there's a little gold. Ah! Oh, that's a lot of bad guys. We just need to get uh, buildings up on the other side. Get a stable down. Uh 
Oh wow, they are aging up quickly. Some more docks down. Oh, I need gold more than I need stone. armor for the scouts and then uh, we can go ahead and take those resources over there. Attack, please. Just attack whatever, dudes. My dudes. the biggest fan of this. Feels like we were kind of dumb. Farms and feudal age. Or tool age. Oh, we need a market for them. Okay, let's do some more scouting. sloppy, but we got there in the end. Okay, we can bring more bills over. Do need more food, though. Oh, here are the Cyrenaikans. What am, I, what am I doing? I have a market. I can just pick up the castle. I'm so dumb. Oh, that's annoying.
All right, so the resources in Anatolia are going to last us a little bit longer. Oh, here's Crete, I think. There's a bit of gold here. Ooh, the Numidians have War Galley. And they're in the Iron Age now, dang. The Etruria Etrurians as well. Get all that stuff. Okay, uh, transports over here. Let us do that. Send five bills over to Crete. The Greeks just got to the Bronze Age. Hopefully our rating from earlier helped with that. got some hop lights out. But we don't actually need to fight the Greeks yet. Actually. Oh, I need to build a uh, government center. Well, now Greeks are in the Iron Age. The Age of Iron. Okay, this is kind of the extent of our uh, naval presence for the moment. Get shared exploration. Okay, get that. Alrighty, okay, so. Wait, what have I done? Those merchant ships going. Oh, wow, these guys have a huge score. transport. Yeah, these plebs don't know what they're doing. Now, I'm not too sure what the ruins that we're supposed to capture are. Bronze Age building. Okay. 
Okay, there are their defenses. I guess the Etrurians are in Italy. That lion is just going to town. Get some more farms going. Okay, let's send these guys over to uh, what will become Carthage. Okay, well, that was no issue. Those tribes stand no chance. Get it up to the Iron Age. Let's help out those guys and uh, kill that. <laughs> PC up there. Those are the Romans. So yeah, I'm not entirely sure what I'm supposed to be looking for, to be honest. Oh, these guys are landing over here. Defensive war elephant. Get some of those. Oh, I forgot. You need an upgrade for towers. guys are strong. Oh, that's where the Numidians are hanging out, and they have cataphracts. Oh, boy. Okay, let's get aristocracy. Need lots of bills on food. Have some phalangites. Oh, 
Ooh, horse archers. But we're getting some ballistas. Now oh, they've got full centurions as Greeks, so they move fast. Hey, you want to stop being a butt? Always an option. Ruins commemorating his exploits. But, like, do I just have to search the entire map for them? Capture Melkert's Ruins. Okay, uh, let's go all the way up to Trirems. Oh, yeah, those are Trirems. Okay, we're going to focus our uh, building over here in Carthage, which makes sense. Get out of here. Can still trade with Tyre. Ballistics. Okay, yeah, we still got lots of text to use here. Oh, those are Heliopoli. Trade bow. Sure. Nope. E for elephant. Hundred thirty five wood for each of these bad boys. Cataphracts mm. are good. Getting 66 gold per trip. Can't really afford a lot of upgrades. where they're located. Or at least where they are primarily holding out. I 
How do you have a work alley and a try rum? Like, sure, I'm going after these guys, and it's, you know, relatively successful so far. I just don't understand the, uh, the end goal here. Oh, wait, I also need to build a government center. armor. Can always go over to Sicily if need be. That's a lot of tri rums. Okay, a couple of war galleys and a merchant ship. I guess those are the ancient sites or whatever that I'm supposed to discover. At least we are pop capped. That's always something. We can go start taking gold over and see Sully. I have to make twenty five percent hit points. Okay. So do I just go and do that? Well, I still need to go find the other ones. Holy cow, that's a big navy. Oh, these guys have one. Greeks have one as well, and maybe the Etruscans, and maybe there's one over in Spain, or to like the far south of the map. We shall have to see. Um, 
send a couple more units over there and just go and destroy all the, the tribes in Spain. We shall bask in the glory of their demise. This guy should be dealing a big one damage. It's just this one uh, horse archer. That's me being an elephant. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it's still a big navy. Do the Assyrians have a naval bonus? Uh, nope. Archers and siege. Wait, do our ships have a naval bonus? Oh, the fire galleys attack faster. We should try some of those. Wait, why do I hear monk sounds? Oh my goodness, these random freaking horse archers. Oh. Awesome. All right, well, there's number three. Get armored elephant. And assuming that there isn't one over here, I imagine there's one in Greece and one in uh, Italy. Continue to destroy stuff over there. And now let's go after the the Romans. Wait, do these guys get seed ships at all? No, they don't. Thought something seemed weird. Train those guys. I mean, these guys definitely have a dock somewhere. All right, there are our Muma kill. Send some bills over. Oh, there are the docks. Get Helopolis. Don't need those two. Burn! I am Trogdor the Burninator.
So then we can go back to our good friends, the Greeks. Guess we can get those guys. No, not my bills. Okay, the tri rams are doing their tri ram things. Taken down that. Okay, so in southern Italy, there are just some tribesmen. I mean, I really do have to imagine that there's something here. In terms of a shrine. Or ruins. I've been playing Zelda. Maybe we loop around over there? Fire ships don't mess around. Now let's transport over here and then we can build up some units. Yeah, there isn't one over here, I'm pretty sure. He's built so fast in everyone. Oh, there it is. I knew it had to be around here somewhere. Any more pop space? Awesome, we got it. Now we just have to figure out where in these parts uh, the last ruin is. Wait, three? Oh, we actually have to maintain them.
All right, scouting time. Things that the Greeks make that aren't ships and centurions don't really feel that powerful. Okay, there those guys are. make sure this isn't up over here. I don't think it would be, but I, I imagine you have to actually get to the enemy base to get the ruins. That's kind of the point. It's not over here. Okay, well, let's see if it's up over here in Illyria. It's a lot of war galleys, but those ain't trirems or fire ships, so I shouldn't be too worried, I think. It's definitely not down here, right? There, there isn't really space for it. There's not going to be two in Spain. Oh, Chieftain has uh, a lot of HP. Okay, it is up over here. Alrighty. Oh, you're still alive. Dang, this video is going to be like an hour long. Malay. Malay. Okay, now they got trirems. All right, make a beeline for it, kids. Oh, 
All right, elephant, it's all up to you. Wait, what? Hold on. I have a town center and a government center. Oh, and a temple! Oh my goodness. No. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. I thought it was a town center and the government center. That is so unfortunate. super hard to reach. Okay, we got it. Dito, your life will be remembered by the poets as one of love and tragedy, but you are, most of all, a mother of a city and of a people. Under your wise rule, Carthage grows and welcomes settlers from Phoenicia. Your people venture out, too, seeking wealth in these western god-touched lands. But Carthage is only one of many cities founded by Phoenician settlers. It is its destiny is to rule them all. Oh, my goodness. That was, uh... Ah, that was tough. You know, we really had to do the whole island hopping thing. Or, like, going to the different colonies and all of that stuff. So that was cool. It felt a little annoying at the end, just getting all these uh, different shrines and holding them. Or ruins! You know what I mean. But, uh... Yeah, still a cool scenario, for sure. Going all, the, all across the Mediterranean. Alrighty, guys, that was Dido City! Next up will be competition, which is in Carthage itself. See you guys next time for that.